We're in the second round. Sixers, Raptors, game one, Joel Embiid. Walking in with the red looking fresh, Kawhi Leonard and the Raptors have won 13 straight home games against Philly dating back to 2013. What would possibly happen in game one? Let's just say Kawhi would come out high. The three is good. Efficient and effective inside the painted area. Toronto up early. The spicy P doing work. That is Pascal Skiakam. Toronto made 13 field goals in a row. Nice moves. Shaq will call that feet work. Drake, your thoughts. MB trusting the process. 16 points in the game. Ben Simmons struggled against Toronto all year. Showing signs. 14 points, 9 rebounds in the game for number 25 in your program. But Kawhi. This was his game. Showing the handles. Putting the moves on Jimmy Butler. And the spin cycle is ridiculous. A playoff career high at the half. 27 points for the claw. Just playing bully ball. Yes. Running through the six with my wolves. Toronto up at halftime. But Reddick, the brotherhood, keeping the Sixers in the game. He had five threes. He wears number 17. He had 17 points, knocking down the J. And all of a sudden, the Sixers are within four. Lowry, Siaka. Lowry goes in, he had nine points in the game. That would cap a 10-0 run. And then the defense, Pascal Siaka. 29 points, seven rebounds in the game. Take a look at the block one more time on Tobias Harris. That is ridiculous. And then Kawhi would put the game away. Three ball, splash. In the painted area with the fadeaway, splash. A career high 45 points in the playoffs, the second most in Raptors postseason history behind Vince Carter's 50 in 2001. Drake showing love. And the Raptors have won five straight playoff games as they get the victory and go up 1 0.